Hi guys, um, looked at part one yesterday with regards to what the lifestyle program is. Uh, wanted to go into a little bit more detail today, but still keeping the video short because I know that you're busy, so I really appreciate you taking the time to have a little look at this. Um, most people that come onto my program, I think expect obviously the weight loss, and that is something that, that genuinely happens. But as the program's gone on a little bit more, um, people are now starting to realize that it's a lot more than that. It's about making other lifestyle changes. Um, so it isn't just about the food. It isn't about exercise. Is It's about actually trying to focus on certain things that you think that are important in your life and where you want to go forward. But a lot of people tend to come along and lose around about four or five pounds in the first week. So I just wanted to show you what four or five pounds actually looked like, okay? Um, someone come to me the other day and said, I thought I was going to lose more than four pounds in the first week because we have had some big hitters. We've had the eight pounds, nine pounds, even up to ten pounds. So this is, this is five pounds worth of weight. So this is a pound, okay? Quite a decent amount. So take that off that, which is probably around about that bit there, and there you're left with four pounds. So if you don't think that's a significant amount of weight to lose in a short period of time, and most people, by the way, tend to lose it from the tummy area. So when we do the measurements, the calculations of chest, waist, hips, and leg, um, the, bu the bulk of it tends to come off on the stomach, which is brilliant because we hold a certain amount of fat there called visceral fat. And this is probably uh, the most dangerous fat of all because it tends to um, surround itself around the internal organs, which is actually really dangerous and actually slows things down. But enough about that. What I wanted to do today was really is just talk to you about looking at your life and where you think that it's going to be like we said yesterday in a month which is probably not going to be that much different six months yet yeah, maybe a year five years ten years down the line and thinking how healthy that you are now but are you actually going to sustain that moving forward and what we do is that we actually um we work with you with regards to tools um stuff that you need to fill in you need to get involved we add you onto a group and when we move forward through a process of really looking at your life and for you to ask your own questions and thinking, well, hang on, is this really is this really of a benefit to me? Is is doing what I'm doing on a regular basis actually going to get me to where I really want to be? Because if it isn't, then we're just back at square one again. A lot of stuff that I do as well with personal coaching um, is, is 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 coaching clients who think that they're actually already there. So directors of companies and people have got their own business, sole traders. Um, and it's pretty exciting that when you break things down and start looking at their lives and they start looking at their own and thinking, okay, well, what is the plan? What's the outcome? And it's a question that really we start looking at right from the beginning. What is it that you want from your training? A lot of personal coaches out there, a lot of personal trainers, and by the way, I'm not a personal trainer, and we do a lot of consultations with clients, but certainly not doing any PT with them. This is really about trying to get your life on track, where it is that you want to be and how you need to get there, okay? I've gone over a little bit there. I only wanted to do a quick two-minute video, and we're up to three minutes and 17 today. So uh, hopefully that you've enjoyed that. I will be back tomorrow with another video, so uh, I look forward to speaking to you then. Take care. Bye-bye.